Last time around on Shop Hustle, we were in the process of rebuilding the used 136-inch skid frame for the Polaris Dragon. That's been done, so all that's left to do is change out the track. Luckily, I've done it on this machine once already this year, so there shouldn't be any surprises. I hope. The skid is already out, so it's time to remove the drive axle and everything in the way of accomplishing that task. So while that's happening, I want to tell you about the track I've chosen for the upgrade. Camso offered to supply the new track for this change to 136 and help figure out which track would be right for the sled and the way I ride, we used the selection tool on Camso's website. This tool steps through all the different tracks Camso has to offer, but also matches those offerings to what fits on your sled. After you input the make and model you're searching for, along with your riding segment, style, and definition, the selection tool will punch out the Camso track that works best in all your preferred categories. In addition, the suggested tracks have ratings for things like traction and flotation to help identify the strengths of each result. From there, it's just a matter of deciding which track looks best for you. We went with the Cobra track option with 1.4 inch lugs. This track has great versatility, which is good for where I ride and the changing snow conditions. Beyond that, through the use of the selection tool, I know for a fact that the track will be a perfect fit for the now Switchback Dragon, which, aside from drilling some new holes in the tunnel, is all stock Polaris. Camso calls themselves a road-free company, which means they specialize in products where rubber meets everything but the road. From forklift tires to ag tracks to snow bikes to your sled, they use this engineering knowledge and corporate power to develop products. By count, Camso has over 30 snowmobile tracks for every type of rider and riding style. Well, with the new 136 inch skid frame installed and the new track, this dragon is ready to ride once I build a little tunnel extension to hold the snow flap. Or maybe I won't. This will be cool. Nobody's going to ride behind me.